So this is a video about uh, a potato experiment that I'm going to start today. It is December 5th. And um, last year we were watching a lot of videos about composting. And, um, and uh, one of the videos was about worm composting in the bed. So you have a bucket and you put holes in it and the worms go in and they eat all your stuff. So she was showing how it worked and she'd lifted off the lid and she started laughing because one of her potato peels had started growing. And I thought, wait a minute. Does that mean that you can just peel your potatoes and get potato plants? Like having your cake and eating it too? So we had some potatoes at our house that were starting to chit. They were just from the store and I carefully peeled them with kind of a thicker uh, piece of potato where the chits were. And then, cause that was like almost a week ago, I wrapped them in paper towels and I put water on them so they would stay moist. So they look like this. So they look like this right now and I haven't unwrapped them, but let's see. They still have chits, you know, they're, they're chitting. They're a little brown now. So those guys are a little brown, but those guys, are, oh look, they're still working. Look, they're totally making a potato plant. So these are from potatoes that we ate. So we got to eat them. And now I'm going to plant these and see what happens. So my husband asked me not to use his precious sweet, sweet compost for this silly experiment. I respect that. Um, so I've put four in here, three in here, because I feel like that one guy right there on the bottom, uh, he is going to be the most viable. He's the one growing the most. Um, this is a combination of leaf mold and then almost composted leaf mold from the golf course. I mix them together on the bottom. It's got about probably six inches on the bottom and I'm just gonna top them up with about three inches. And then there's probably something else I need to put in potatoes. What do I need to put in potatoes? Pardon me? Like bone meal or something? Do we have anything like that? We got uh, blood meal. Sure, why not? Okay, so I will put some blood meal in there and then cover them up. Perfect. All right, this is great experiment time. This is the conclusion of the can you grow a potato from a peeling of a potato. So I've got my two grow bags. Now they did have leaf. They, you know, they made things that made it look like there's gonna be potatoes. And so I'm just gonna crack in there and see if there's any potatoes in there. I don't even, it was store-bought. Mm -hmm. And it did take forever for it to show any growth, right? Yeah, but I planted you, it in the fall. You planted it in the fall, which is crazy to me, but good for you when we had the potatoes okay this is this is my theory of if you you can grow potatoes mm. like you know and you don't have to worry about oh how many potatoes do i get or whatever uh you can see that i used these grow bags um oh look at all the wormies gotta save so we need to save those they're babies yes they'll go in with the, the other one okay um we'll see we're not expecting big things here sports fans so okay oh my god okay i got a big potato definitely worth <laughs> definitely worth oh wow i got two big potatoes no these are store bots these are store bought yellow um, gold something like that okay awesome hun from a from potato skin. peel Okay. Yep. Now, in my defense, I did uh, cut pretty thick in a couple places where I saw the eyes. <laughs> um, I don't know how. And look, it's 
Is that that famous word? Yeah, that thing. What did you call it? Friable. Friable. Okay. Well, that's awesome. I can't okay. believe that we got so potatoes one, from Peels. I've one. seen it on YouTube, but yeah. I didn't believe it. I didn't think so either. You know. Um, okay, I think that's good. I'm going to do... I mean, Tony O'Neill only got 235 pounds. pounds out of his compost from potato peels. But Bucket number two. By bucket, I mean. Did I talk about this already? So we're, I use these... Um, for to grow these potatoes, but we have since moved to the plastic containers. Mm -hmm. um, they are bigger, the plastic containers, and they hold the moisture better. So that's yep. why we moved to those. And these things are only, what, a year old? Yeah. And they're already starting to break down a lot. So it's kind of, I don't know. I know people bag on plastic, but... Well, we're going to reuse the plastic a lot. Okay, I found mm -hmm. one. Okay. Well... We're already into bonus territory now. Uh oh. 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 <gasps> We're having potatoes for dinner. Nice. From I'm I'm just blown away. Blown away. Oh. Oh. They look good too. Don't they though? I think we should save these guys and put them in a serious pot you know like a plastic yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah we got to start potting up our christmas potatoes <gasps> asap look at all the little guys little guys okay so this bag for whatever reason smaller potatoes no conclusions on Need soil medium although you can see this is leaf mold that might based on our other experiments that might be what led to the decent growth mm -hmm. um but yeah you can grow potatoes from the peels mm -hmm. and get yourself some potatoes so any amendments did you put any amendments in there do you remember i will have to look in the video okay but i've done nothing i i mean we did water them when we mm -hmm. watered everything else but Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't put anything on top. I probably should have. All right. <gasps> One more. This is why you check. There's more in there. We we know it. You know it. They know it. There's more. There's going to be potatoes all throughout the garden. Okay. Okay. Look at that. You know why your hands aren't dirty at all? Shh. Not dirty at all? It's because it's friable. Ooh. Stay awesome, guys. It's super hard to film when something's biting your leg. I know, I know, I, uh, I know. I know. One day, we'll get a tripod, one day. We'll be able to use one of those carrots. <laughs>